the 50 25 25 rule to freedom and profit i want to share with you right now this tool that i built to figure out what you need to charge in order to have a life of freedom and profit i devised this formula and i actually have a great tool for you that you can use where you can just plug in your numbers and find the price you need to charge it's called the price to freedom calculator i devised this when i realized that i was only working on my business when there was like extra time or on the weekends it was always on the back burner so maybe at night, maybe a little bit here and there, but I never had a consistent system for working on my business. And because of that, I hadn't built enough value in my business, in my marketing, in my outreach strategy and any of that. So I was always stuck looking for clients. And if you don't want to be stuck looking for clients all the time, you have to put dedicated time aside to work on your business. That's the only way that you will build a machine or build a system so that you can attract ideal clients and you don't have to keep hunting and networking for them for the rest of your life, which some people do because they never put time aside to work on their business. This is the formula that I developed in order to ensure that I had plenty of time available to work on my business to make it more valuable. And it made all the difference. Here goes. I believe that you need to be able to make all of the revenue that you need, the revenue. Revenue includes the money that you need to pay yourself to live, the money that you need to spend on your business and operating your business and your taxes. All of that together equals your revenue. I believe you need to make all your revenue as a service business working with clients at a maximum of 50% of your time or less. So if you think about it over the course of a year, that means only six months of that is working with clients. If you think about it over the course of a month, that means two weeks max is how much time you're working with clients. And I like to use a 40 hour work week because we're all used to a 40 hour work week, which means you would be working on average only 80 hours a month with with clients and you need to generate all of your revenue that you need just from those average 80 hours a month. And that's the 50% of the 50, 25, 25 rule. If you're able to do that, you can spend the next 25% of your time. So that's, let's say a week a month or three weeks a year working on your business. Imagine how valuable your business would be if you were spending an average of an entire 40 hour work week on your business every single month. I promise you, you would see huge changes in your business within month two, because most people are not putting that kind of dedicated effort into building the value of their business. So that's the second 25, 50, 25, 25. The third 25 in the 50, 25, 25 rule is for you. It's your free time for a number of reasons. One, we didn't go into business so that we could work 52 weeks a year, but also it's building in time for yourself and also for things that are unexpected. Have you ever been working in your business and then something happens in your life? Something throws you off, you get sick, a family member gets sick, you have to go to a funeral or something exciting happens. You win a trip to Bermuda. I don't know, you're on the Price is Right or something and you win a trip and you gotta go on this trip. And then everything gets thrown out of whack because you didn't plan for having taking this week off. Instead, I like to plan for that week or that three months a year minimum in my pricing. So the 50, 25, 25 rule is broken down as client work, working on your business and free time. And when you are looking to fit into this formula, I use this formula to figure out how much to charge. So you have your revenue and you know that you need to make it in 50% of your time or less. And then it's just basic math, doing some calculations to figure out, oh, if I want to have this amount of time available to work on my business and grow it and also have personal time and have this life that I want, I have to charge X dollars for every project. And it is so enlightening. I've had people go like, oh my God, I had no idea what the numbers really needed to be in order to have the business that I want. Because most people, they close a project and then they just work however much they need to work on it in order to finish the project. And they have no concept of how much time they spend, which I get, I know from personal experience that that's kind of the default way to do it. But if you figure out what your price to freedom is, then you will, first of all, it'll turn your brain on to start paying attention to how much time these projects take. But it'll also give you a really clear goal because chances are you're probably not charging that amount yet. And that's okay. The reason I want you to know what your price to freedom is, is because then it gives you a clear goal that you can work towards. Once you know, oh, that's what I need to be charging in order to have this life and business that I want, then you can start to look at, well, how does my business operate right now? 
why can't I charge that? Or how can I decrease the amount of time that I spend on projects or with clients in order to make it more profitable? So it's a really eye-opening tool. I also have a much more detailed, still easy to fill in, but much more detailed and comprehensive version of this called the Freedom Calculator in the No BS Agency Mastery Program. It's a really core element of what I teach and how to price your services, package your services, and do it in a way that is going to support exactly the life that you want and get rid of all the stress of, am I charging enough? Am I getting enough clients? All of these things. When you know exactly how much you need to charge and how many clients you need to get, it takes the weight of the world off of your shoulders because now you know, for example, oh, I only need 10 clients this year at this price point to pay for my entire life and my entire business. And once you know that, then you can put all of your energy into just finding those 10 clients and that's it. Or maybe 20 clients, or maybe it's 30 clients at lower prices. It doesn't matter what the numbers are. The point is you should know off the top of your head, I need this many clients paying this much and I will be able to pay for my entire life. And that is freedom. That's what we all want here, isn't it?